Oh, baby, I love you every day. Yeah, yeah. I want to be with you night and day. All right, what is going on, everybody? So, if you didn't know, there is a delay on YouTube, so that's why. But, we're going to jump into some Red Dead Redemption. That is the plan. So, we're going to play some RDR2. And, um, we're going to go from there. I don't know how far we're going to get. This is an extremely long game. That's all I got to say. For whatever reason, it's not popping up. Boom. I'm trying to put it that we are live in the Discord right now. But yet, the Discord, it's not popping up. It's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Alright. But, hopefully you guys are doing well. Today is what? Tuesday? So that means it's Taco Tuesday. Which, I love tacos. That's all I gotta say. I think, uh, I think I'm gonna have some tacos here in a little bit. We... We're taking so long, it kicked into cinematic mode. Well... Alan just texted me. All he said was, well. Wait, what? Okay. You need any help with that food? All right. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Tell me something good. Bow, bow. Tell me, tell me, tell me. I think it's funny how fast people jumped in here when they saw us playing Sea of Thieves yesterday. All right. So let's get into it. Some... Red Dead Redemption 2. So we got camp funds at thirteen dollars and ninety-two cents. We ha we have not gotten far whatsoever in this game. Welcome in everybody. Hopefully you guys are doing well. All right. So let's go to the different stories. Your beard is getting long. You can shave your kit. No, I'm not. I want to grow my beard. I don't care what anybody says, I'm going to grow my beard. Jesus Christ, hold on. Yeah, I'm on stream. What's up? Yeah. No lie, I just hit the go live button two minutes ago. Bye, what's up? Yo, what's up, C's? You, you, you sure? Uh, okay, okay, I'll watch you later, dude. Yeah. Bye. That was Alan, by the way, guys. All right. Damn, Red Dead. Yeah, dude. I've been I've been wanting to play through uh, Red Dead Redemption on stream here for a hot minute. But I just haven't yet. I think uh, I'm, like, torn because I want to play... I know everything. Oh, I might have to rely on you then. Like, dude, I'm telling you, hands down, the bet, the, the the first Red Dead Redemption. I'm not talking Red Dead Revolver. I'm talking about Red Dead Redemption. I. It's telling me this game needs an update. We'll update it later because I don't plan on playing online. in my controller but uh yeah my controller's like blinking right at me and everything but uh yeah the first red dead we're we playing as john i freaking i love it all right let's go see what uncle wants over here Yeah, I've played Red Dead Redemption 1 and 2. I haven't played Red Dead Revolver. I actually have Red Dead Revolver for my GameCube. Oh, oh, oh. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. <laughs> so, <laughs> while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Yeah, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? 
See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. I'm actually thinking about it. I actually have it on my Xbox. You gonna take the old man into town? Not my GameCube. Take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Dude. Grimshaw. <laughs> like, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robbing. You're worried about house chores. All I gotta Let's say go. is most Rockstar games, the Fair story enough. is you got me. Come phenomenal. On. <laughs> That's why I'm not complaining about, you know, Feels like GTA 6 yeah. taking 15 Valentine. years to come out. Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> you ladies are gonna love it. Okay, then. Let's Wanted to play go. what? All right. Oh, no. Are you I'm talking about the VR chat right. you texted me about earlier? I'll probably play some VR chat later. It's like this is my last week of freedom before I uh, I start my new job. Yep. Right. Wee. Lady. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I may. I may actually hit you up play some VR chat later. Go right here. Oh yeah, the, dude, the amount of stuff that they buried in this game is ridiculous. And on top of that, the graphics are just phenomenal. He's gonna lose a wheel. I oh, lost the horses. Is one of you going to get that fella's horse? Well, I got lumbago. It's very serious. All Speak right, to the coach I'll driver. Going on. Lucky lumbago there ain't story related. Really. We can take a couple of them if you want. Sure, no, not right man. now. Oh, hey. You we could, uh, we could discover them as we go on. Over there, could you? <laughs> I'd really appreciate the help. I I'm worried this one here will bolt on me too if I leave him. We gotta calm the horse down. Why he doesn't bolt? Whoa, now he's easy. Shh, girl. There we go. We got him. We got him, boys. Whew, it's like I'm a horse whisperer. But yeah, freaking uh, the depth of the story for Red Dead Redemption 2 is ridiculous. Like, I've watched a lot of videos talking about it. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, uh, thank you. I think we did that. We impressed the ladies. Gentlemen. Uh, can you do another old fella a favor? Get back on the damn wagon. Oh, the oh, horse was in the way. To Valentine! <laughs> <laughs> Turn it into a regular old yeah, Alan, when you gonna if you're in chat still, when are you gonna beat this I mean, game? A, a small one perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you have it, your pulse of old lizards. Blizzards have heart. Have to go far out of the way to find them, bro. I spent IR spent IRL days worth of time. I mean, it's crazy. Oh yeah. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. Be honest, I I believe that. Hey, Alan, does this area look familiar? I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> <laughs> nice You're driving, Grandma. Smell those sheep. 
<laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. Where's that uncle? This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Mom to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of <laughs> I'm gonna stop so you can play the game. Dude. Jesus, a so, like, right I have yet to beat okay. RDR2. Take a good I beat RDR1 and Let's I beat Revolver. There's always on and the then... Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Like, this is the there only Rockstar game I haven't beaten yet. Like, and talking, all, like, story, story-wise. Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. That's probably down not. down the end there, near the stable. You got huh. a problem? Ungoddamn believable. All right. Here we are, just like I said. <laughs> Cultural center of civilization. Uh, when this game Man, came out, I was still active duty in the military. Okay. We so doing? I was like busy, well, busy. So I didn't have time to actually play does. it. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll He's see you at the some general store when you're drinky done. drinks. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Imagine we're in Paris. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, yeah, it. In my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> but it, I will okay. admit, it took I'm me... Ask why. You are a it was like a year and a half to beat the first one because it came well, out, I, I went to boot camp, me. and then like a bunch of stuff popped up. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. <laughs> I lied. Ringworm, then rats with, rats the plague, with the plague, then you, then you. <laughs> Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Morning. Howdy. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, oh, it's going to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there. I'm also going to purchase. Why don't store. you pick up some coffee while we're here? Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Dude, there's no way that he could be Red Harlow. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Okay, if you're done, we got some I'll coffee. I won't be too long. Yeah, let's browse the so, catalog. You're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? So we See got this? provisions. Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. Canned food, liquor, what do you tobacco. Read? Lamb or the sausage? So let's see well, where you go back. Well, this town. The lamb's the ammunition. best in the state. Let's see how much ammunition know what the smell is. Well, that's it's crazy because, right. like, this is so... Like in depth. Let's see what uh, hunting and fishing. Let's see. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Herbivore yep. bait. That's fine whiskey. Cover scent lotion. That should do us. Let's go wait for the mouse. You know how right I'm. All the best, fellers. Another part of that map on my... Oh, I didn't know that. I'll have to check that out when I get there. Here, let's look at horse care. Let's see if there's anything good. Horse... Uh, what is it? Horse medicine. Potent horse medicine. There's all kinds of stuff you could do. All right. And then clothing. Let's see. I got $20 to spend. What? That's eighty-five dollars. What? What? There's no way. We're in like the eighteen hundreds, and some bitch wants eighty-five dollars for a suit. All right, let's go catch up with Uncle. He said he'd be outside. He's probably out there drinking, drinking his problems away. It looks like Maker's Mark right there on the count uh, on the shelf. All right, let's go. Let's go talk to him. See, I told you he's out there drinking. Whoa. 
here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time my career, yeah, that's what I'm I saying. pictured myself being married to an heiress. $85, you're buying like 20 acres of land. Like, that's all I gotta say. I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. Oh, boy. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Ken? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. Excuse me. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's an intro. Oh, there's Tilly over there. Uh -oh. That does not look ideal. Excuse uh -oh. me. Oh, let's go bust this up. You can go kiss the Defuse the argument. Get off me! Get off of me! I've been looking too long. Get your hands off me, mm. friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> the real question is, am I going to be able to... Exactly. You want to find out? I'm going to find out. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right away now. with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Search for Karen. Karen's the one always in trouble, man. I'll tell you what. I do all I can manage. I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk feather. Mid twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in two B upstairs. Are you uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. Two B upstairs. That's the the one thing no I do really now, do really like about this game is the fact that like the uh, the music changes as you go on. friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I paid. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here. I paid for nothing. Think you two could... Think you're tough? What the hell are you doing here? Try to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? That's all, yeah. bitch. I accidentally pulled out my my Don't handgun. I didn't mean to do that. Man, yo, what up, Trout? Stupid bastard! Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this allows. Talk about another town. person that loves this game. Lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Didn't you platinum this game or no? Keep investigating. Okay I will. Now we gotta go outside. We're about you. to get into another fight. And, and to think, I was, I was thinking I was rich this whole time with twenty dollars in my wallet. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. One hundred percent completion. You okay? Sure. Oh, he only damn. punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. With a bunch awesome. of fillers. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Shit, bro. Just borrowing it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Where the hell did he go? How legitimately? Oh, there. It's on the radar. I'm 
a dummy. Question is, y'all. We save him, or do we let him go? Help someone! Why are you telling lies about me? No, no, I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I was thinking. I usually do the right I thing. I try to play like in black water. Then why as are if you chasing me? I like. I'm actually I the character. Of course, other than killing people. Yes. Yes, me too. <laughs> now please pull me up, please. I think I might save him. I can't him. hold on much longer. Save him, okay. All right, come on. Chat has spoken. We're saving him. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. Hold on, just a second. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us. I don't get if it. We pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You Arthur Morgan, exactly. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh, here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. <sighs> That's very kind of you. But I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not Yo, what's now, up, man? Not, not never. How you doing, man? I think we have an understanding. No, of Hopefully you're doing do. well, dude. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. Sorry, like, I'm getting I sucked in haven't. at how not, not visually stunning this game not is. And this game came out like six years ago. In this year old mind. <laughs> I'm like over here just cool. like watching cool. the cutscene. Nice I am in you. Dude, I'm doing really well. I'm just chilling, man. Um, dude, but yeah, this like this game. Oh man, yeah, dude, this game's amazing. Like, it, it really yeah. genuinely is. It's visually stunning, and I'm trying to remember. I think I got through Act Two, bro. I need a RDR three. Yeah, dude. Like, it's just, it's so visually appealing. Like, I'm sitting here, and I'm just, like, I look over, I see Ian going, yo. And, like, I'm just so wrapped up in how visually stunning this game is. Yep. Like, <laughs> I'm, like, it just completely, it blows my mind. And, like I said, it's, it's been this, six years. Everything there. Focus on the story. Yeah, the story is amazing. Like I said, I made it to chapter two before I I, uh, I stopped playing the last time. I never finished this game. Like uh like I was telling C's, um, like this is the only Rockstar like narrative driven game I have not beaten of theirs. Am I glad to see you? You've been kicked in the head out of the damn way. What do you need something? Hello there. Oh, uh, man. It's so mo For real. Yeah, no, you ain't lying. I wonder what RDR3 would be about. Maybe Dutch's backstory. What Jack done after the events of RDR1. Dude. You know, I kind of wish that they RDR3 would focus on, like, a U.S. Marshal or something. Or one of the Pinkertons. Yeah. In the same universe. If that, like, makes any amount of sense. I 
I would. I think that would be the amazing part. Like, where is this dude? Dude, that like I said, like it doesn't even have to be anybody that we've seen already in the game. I'm just like, you know, thinking about what would make a really good story in like a Pinkerton or a U.S. Marshal. And you're on the other side. Instead of being an outlaw, you're a good guy for once. And you, of course, like Wyatt Earp and all of them, they made bad decisions. They were wanted outlaws that became lawmen. Oh, Arthur, Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Well, ain't you just the toughest teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. <laughs> a pussy no cat. Her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This well, game is visually appealing. Say, it's been out for six years. Got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charmer. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it Are easy, you about pal. to kiss that guy or punch easy, him? Huh? Oh, and we have about to kiss that guy or about to punch him. Oh, man. Come here, you. You mean bastard. Oh, come on. We can handle these fools. Oh, no, not my hat. Pick up our hat. Are you joining us, Arthur? You fell into a joke. Why is it not letting me fight? Come on. It's not letting me do anything. There we go. What the hell is going on down here? It wasn't letting me do anything. Come here, you little greaser. You punk. Yeah, I get like a girl. Let's go. Oh, God. He's going to pick me up, put me through the window. Watch. Where Bam! Come on, pretty boy. Pretty boy? You're kidding me. Pretty boy? Knock his head off! I said that be fun, didn't I? Woo! Try that! Try that again! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, we gotta break free! We gotta break free! Bam! Get him! Come on, Arthur! Yeah! Come on! Ah! We gotta break free! We go! Come on, Arthur! There we go. <laughs> it's like the short street beeps. Yeah, you ain't lying. Come on. Bam. We're gonna beat him up. Hey, come on, stop that. Stop, stop. Please, please, I beg you, stop. Come, sir. You won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? No business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. We gotta go get our hat. Making new friends again, I Hell see, yeah. Arthur. <laughs> Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. Well, well, I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must <laughs> be joking. How are you? Well. 
quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah! Javier and Charles! I've missed you! And Bill looking as well as can be? Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. I'm gonna have to we left check a lot that of out. Money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's oh, talk no. of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater, uh, ah. Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. We gotta try, baby. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, we're well, gonna go that, get our half first, so we, what we don't that lose mean? that. Oh, Bill. Come on. Yeah. So we got bronze. That's fine. Let's pick up our hat. Let's go get cleaned up. Multiple missions. Yada, yada, yada. We gotta go to Saints Hotel, I believe it is. Because I think that's where the, uh, the bath and everything is. It's been a hot minute. How are you? We get a good night's sleep as well. This is one of them days. I'm very sorry to hear that. Hot meal. Let's do a bath. I See, baths are 25 that's cents. Okay, can you organize? <laughs> I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. Okay, thanks. No, oh, it's uh you. Yes, it is. Last <laughs> time I checked. I, but I really uh don't need any more trouble. I didn't come to make any. I was but just see, protecting this is the thing. a lady. There we go. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. I want Arthur to have a beard like me. Scrub head. Gotta make sure we. Can I be of any assistance in there? Yeah, we'll oh, we'll pay her the fifty good. cents. Yeah, thanks. See, that's what I don't get is that one outfit was like eighty-seven dollars. I just paid a quarter and a hooker to bathe me for seventy-five cents. I don't get it. Well, she ain't a hooker. She's a lady. We'll, we'll rephrase that. Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. Hope the water's hot enough. Some parts of me probably ain't been this clean in months. Well. Yeah, that's what I've heard. But no, so I trim my beard because I'm supposed... I trim my beard actually. Um, I trimmed my beard like a month ago because it my beard was down to he, like what, roughly here because I was supposed to start a new job. I'll be out of your hair in no time. And um, ain't often to get a hot yeah like yeah. And roof and over I still haven't even started yet. Really now, oh, dude, I might have to do that. I might have to shave his head. So how are things with you? Yes, not too bad. Just right. The question is, is like when he does bats like this, does it actually wash his clothes as well? Or do we have to like find somewhere to wash his clothes? Doesn't that feel good now? If that makes any amount of sense. Last few months, probably been the toughest of my life. Ooh. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's okay, honey. Oh, man. Mm. 
The beard reminds me of Kratos. Yeah, I'm like a fat Kratos. I need to shave my head too, man. I've kind of been pushing off now. shaving my head. I had a kid tell me that. Thanks. It was nice getting to know you. That makes sense. For whatever reason, like, I was just was thinking about, okay, yeah, his clothes are clean now. Okay, so when you get a bath, it cleans everything. Note to self. I did not want to go in there. Yeah, you should shave it. Thanks, Ian. But, uh, <laughs> no, I've just been pushing off. I've been lazy. That's all it is. So for 75 cents, guys, back in 18... Uh, what year does this game take place? I think it's like 1880s. You could get a bath, clean clothes, and bathed by a hooker. Hom homie's running for his horse. Oh, I didn't want to do that. 1899, yeah, that's it. That's all I'm saying, like... Bro, like I said earlier, all right, here. Let's go to the general store here. All right. Look out. Let's, let's come in here, right? I just want to show you. I, I know C's already saw this earlier. Back for and I don't think you were in here yet. This is what I'm trying to get at. I was like, uh, Big brown time they stole in a bad way from that fight. Let's figure out a, whole, a way to time travel. Bro, you're telling me. Hold on, here. Let's go to clothing, right? Outfits like the first thing I look eighty five dollars and fifty cents for this outfit. So what do you get for eighty five dollars and fifty cents in eighteen ninety nine? But yeah, no. All seriousness, though, like I think this time period would be like that's it. I mean, nowadays, okay, in twenty twenty four, eighty five dollars and you know whatever. Like that's a good, that's a hell of a deal. In 1899, that's like 20 acres and a fucking horse, man. Thank you for your help. There's my horse. All right. Increase your bond with the horse. Okay. Um. Here, let's take a look. Let's see where we should head to next. There's a time traveler you could talk to in the game, actually, the Mao. It's another Easter egg. At that at that time, it was a lot. Yeah, it was a ton back then. Like nowadays, like I said, I'm, I'm wondering what's over here. So let's see if we can't find out what's going on over there. It's a big old white bubble. But uh, yeah, dude. Like like I said, it's just there's another saloon right here. I think they said that, but they haven't officially confirmed it, if that makes any amount of sense. Alright, here. There's a you have a discover a stranger in here. Alright, let's take a look. Come on, sir. Try to remember. What oh, really happened at Sylvia's saloon back in 76? Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Who's that your does... friend there? Ha! Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? I'm going to have to find him. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well... I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that Absolutely. down. Absolutely. If I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. 
I mean, <laughs> folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. I don't hey, you take so. it easy, C's. I'll catch you later, homie. But you like fortune. I, I hey, expect a okay. more and RDR this me, week. I'm gonna a try to play a lot more. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it. And well, there's a whole list of gunfighters, legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Billy Bell. Billy Midnight. Never heard of him. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity. Shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but. You want me to go and find some sad, deluded fools like him? Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot them? It does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds <laughs> of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what That's I a lot. Do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to them. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck so here. So we got to find four return. of them. Here are some other flop house. What? I lost 50 cents just for going and talking to homie there. What? How does you? All right, girl. All right, let's take a look at the map. Let's see where our next, uh, all of our stuff's going to be here at the camp. Well, let's go back. Let's make it back to base camp, get some missions, and go from there. Yeah, so I think what the plan is, is for the rest of the week, I'm going to try to wake up uh, at, like, early, make my breakfast. Because, like, that's one thing I absolutely love is having, like, a really good breakfast to start off my day. And then uh, just play, like, a couple hours of RDR every day this week. Because today's Tuesday. Yeah. I mean, I'm probably, I'm definitely not going to be able to beat it this week before I go back to work. So we'll, we'll have to see how far I can get. I think that's going to be the plan. At least, like, it sounds like a really good plan in my head. Because, like, a lot of people enjoy uh, Fortnite. There's a rabbit. Yeah. And don't get me wrong, I love Fortnite as well. But this kind of a... Uh, a nice little break from fork knife. Just playing some RDR. Give me some really good, like, narrative driven story, single player experience. Like, oh. That's one thing, like, I don't think that there's enough of that they don't make enough really good, like, single player experience games. Because, like, think about it. They did. Good evening, right. Arthur. Good evening. Um, hitch the horse. Um, I feel like a lot of studios really like bailed on like really good single player experience games. Hey, Arthur. Jose. Let's go hunting. You want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, huh. I saw a huge bear, one of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God, it's a big ass bear. Come with you. Of course, let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big <laughs> loudmouth bastard tried to rob me without <coughs> riding, so I... How's everybody doing tonight? Oh, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way. 
sort of. If there's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. Okay. But I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Oh, uh, I guess you're right. Oh, man. This is going to be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. <laughs> I'm near yeah, him. Oh, my nice. God. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. It's like a Clydesdale, basically. Good boy. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. There, boy. Are you going to mount up? Easy, big fella. All right, that's a, let's head That's a big-ass horse. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real oh, horse. Yeah, let me pull off my waypoint so I'm not looking at it like, you know. Because this is Valentine. This is where we have to head to anyways. We'll mark the saloon. One. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, uh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've done that before. Uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe Bill you're right. Bill. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. So where's this, where's this tax shop at? Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. We'll get even old Scratch to give God some thanks. Yeah, good boy. There we go. Morning there. I was like, I was going in my head. I'm like, which one's on the left? L3. sell that big brute and buy yourself a horse okay i'm going off to the general store get a few things to lure that bear out with <laughs> meet you back here in a bit all right let's get him hey how can i help you i'm in the market for a new horse something strong and fast yeah, well you're in the right place i got some beauties in at the moment <laughs> yeah and what about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I sure you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. Let's get it. Pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable them here for you. Here, take a look. Let's see. How much? So we can sell him. Here, let's look at the... So speed, handling, heavy, acceleration, terrible. So we're going to sell him. All right. Ooh. Dutch warm blood. We can't get that. But we can get ourselves a Morgan. Which... Riding... Morgan coat and it's a female but we can't we can't get the American standard let me tell you I've worked with horses before and uh the paints the American standards all of them like they're, they're really nice we'll just buy the Morgan for now 
Wait, what should we name him? Ooh. We're going to name him Silver. <laughs> Let's see, tax and services. Um, I already got all that, I thought. Appearance. Short, long, braided. But see, it costs money for all the. Wait, we could get a mohawk. I'm not. I'm not going to spend any money on all that because, like, this isn't going to be my end game horse. This is just like my my starter horse, if that makes any amount of sense. And then services. Let's see, horse care package. Okay, so it doesn't give me anything. So we'll just we'll go with the services, right? We'll get we'll get the horse care package. This is like hopefully it has like an extended card warranty or some shit like that. All right, let's check it out. So that's a yellow saddle. Oh man, that's terrible. Cuz these are all western saddles, yeah. Pre-purchase saddle. I'm trying to think. Where do I want to go with? So, by the way, you you know how to tell the difference between an English saddle and a Western saddle, right? So, English saddle will not have the little. You see the the horn nose at like the front of the saddle. That right there is what signifies a Western saddle. A English saddle, which, like I said, all these are. Western, yeah, um, all the all all of them, but like an English saddle, it just it has the slopes, but it doesn't have um, the um, the horn nose at the front. You'd be surprised at how many people don't actually know that. Oh wait, that's an eighty-five dollar saddle. How much is this one then? $65? What? Yeah, we're, we're, we're not getting any of that. But let's see. Saddlebags? Upgraded saddlebags. Saddlebag? Upgraded saddlebags. It's just slightly bigger. That's about all it is. Let's check out the stirrups. Okay. Do we... Because we got the slim... I like the look of those ones. Eh. 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 Nah. The safety stirrup. I'm not. Yeah, see the horn, the horn nose. The, that's this right here is what signifies a uh, Western saddle. Oh man, there's a bunch of them. I'm like debating: is it even worth? It ain't worth getting any of them. Blankets. So, like... Bro, like... You know what's funny is I used to have a uh, horse blanket. A horsehair blanket on the back of my couch for the longest time. I got it from... Uh, uh, I, used to, I used to do road trips all the time. And I got it from, like, a uh, road trip cross country. I stopped at a uh, reservation. And... Uh, while I was in the uh, reservation, they had a bunch of them. And, like, I was like, I, I got to buy one. So I bought it. And it was actually, like, a horsehair blanket slash poncho. Dude, it was so nice. I don't know where it's at. Because I used to wear it when I would get cold in the house. Uh, all right. All right, We're done. partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. Fucking speaking you of carrots. I know he's going to look after you just fine. 
Speaking of carrots, man, I went earlier to go get some carrots for the dogs, right? Because, um, Logan, Logan's been wanting some carrots. I could not find full-size carrots anywhere around here. I was like, God damn it. Yeah, we'll eat them out. Are you going to mount that new horse of yours or not? He's a real right, guy, too. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run. Up in the mountain. Oh, let's uh, take the waypoint off as well. There we go. It's east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back Welcome in, the everybody. Mountains. Hopefully, you guys are having I'm a wonderful sure day. Figure on that. Don't forget, mash that like button, subscribe if you're ever on YouTube, if you're on Kick or you, uh, Twitch, man. Throw me a follow, it's free. Just welcome in, hopefully you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful Taco Tuesday. I think it's so funny because I've been, I'm like sitting here reminiscing about all my travels across the, to the west from the east coast. This horse is so small. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's Cole. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Dude, my horse is so small. I should have gotten the bigger horse. I should have gotten the upgrade. Dude, the, this game's so beautiful, man. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Stone Pond. We're going the right way. Moonstone Pond, I'll tell you what. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other Horse. side. Go boom, boom. Huh. Okay. So we're gonna have to buy more carrots. Here. Give me one second, I'll be right back. I gotta run to the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys.
back, you guys! Welcome back, welcome back. Let's go take down this bear. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains to see about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him. So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty huh. dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Not right, really. But if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. I'll try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. You just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes, and obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. mean to do that. Alright, let's check this out. That was a pretty good shot, wasn't it? Hell oh, yeah. All right, so we got to head back good up here. Job. All right. It's getting late. Wreck we should camp here. Sure. Items. Now then, you get us set up. All right, we're setting up base camp, baby. Uh, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. So it says craft menu. Uh, playing game, which is all we're cooking. I guess to cook. Let's uh, let's cook her up, baby. And then R2D. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. We're going to stir it away. How much rabbit do I have to cook? We're just going to cook it all up and like stir it away. Because we might as well. Otherwise, I don't want it to go to waste. Watch it be like I'm cooking the same piece. I would laugh so hard. Okay, I'm out. So we, we can't craft anything else. Leave that menu. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. Seven it's hours. All this drama. That's actually a lot of sleep, seven hours.
first light, dude. Man, my nose is itchy. I'm sorry, you, guys. you ready? Oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Oh, I love coffee. Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Let's mix her up. Fish, berries. I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. All right. Hi, girl. In the mountains, Arthur. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Okay. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Hold it. Circle to cancel. Come on, grab your stuff. Let's go. Circle to leave. Alright, let's wrap her up. Okay. Horse care let's items go. and ammunition. Okay. Alright, let's come over here to the horse. He's about to get mad at me. I'm gonna. Alright, let's feed her real quick. There we go. Now let's get on. Come on, girl. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? Yeah, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. It didn't last long. I drifted back into it. Yep. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. Staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, nice. let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's look by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. What is this? Oh, there's some ball marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. This legendary bear. The tracks go into those trees. See more tracks over here. Big old poo over there. Wait a minute. That's a fish, Something actually. On the ground here. What is it? Half eaten fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Oh, 
Someone else on the ground. There, Dung. There she T is. Wood. Watch your step. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. We gotta keep on going. We lost him? For now. Definitely did. Uh, a little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Bait. Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Open satchel. That's what we want. Drop it. Wait. Where's my long arm? A thousand pounds, you say? More or less. Big scar down his face. <laughs> hey, Bro. did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? <laughs> I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Hey, what the hell? Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Something doesn't sit like sit well with me at him going over to the bait. I'm waiting, I'm waiting for the damn bear to pop out. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? Homie I'm a little him. old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well, you coming or not? Yeah, we're going back. We're going back, I'm baby. I'm going with you. Let's get going, going. then. Let's head back to base camp. At least now we can hunt legendary animals. Let's see if Dutch gives us any crap about disappearing like that. I don't need another. We gotta be out there making money speech. We were just out scoping a lead. He doesn't need to know it's a big furry one. Well, yeah. thanks. What Arthur. up, Alan? I probably owe you one. 
Did you hunt down the man bear pig? Al Gore said it's out there. Look into something. That bear looked like man bear pig. Uh, new horse available to purchase at. Uh, duh, duh. Wait, hey, actually, Alan. Speaking of which, how far did you get in this game? We're gonna go to the K. Morning, Arthur. Cause like, uh, I don't think you got too far, did you? Hell, not a bad day for it. My arms is gonna fall off. You got some speaking to do of your own. Not that old gang of yours. I said, I told you, I don't know nothing. That's what I thought. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Oh, shit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, <laughs> who am I? Oh, no. One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Uh -huh. Geld him. Oh, yeah! <laughs> What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastards! Oh, what do you want from me? <laughs> well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll tell uh -oh. you. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you, no offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. We, we gonna, we gonna go and check this out. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. You, you keep sure saying that. Shit was. John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, but I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Let's go to our horse. Pay your buddies our respect. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I'll I give you more directions when we're close. Past Valentine. All right, I'll leave. <laughs> Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an O'Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. <laughs> Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Doug said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something... How give it to me. You give it to me. Instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it. Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey. Hey. If I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah. Wait, are we even near Valentine? Here's Valentine. Okay, so he said it was up past Valentine. That dude is hot. I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. How you holding up, John? Fine. Still ain't right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed rest. Hey, <laughs> all right. Abigail wouldn't let me up. You know her. She won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a failure of reason, Hiding behind your woman, we were getting shot at. 
And I'd do the same for you, if you was in a bad way. I hope so. But I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, yep. O'Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what he does to his enemies. I got an inkling of what you all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. Well, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. It'll do the Keep job. Keep that in your mind, young feller. Right at the forefront of them. Now we go left. The uh, road will take us up and round. Get it. Those are the hills. Head for them. Save your Head. horses. We gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't yeah. know nothing about this game. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscoll. There's a skunk. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourselves. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. We're out to live. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on them. Now. Who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. now. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet, taking them out as we find them, trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. Settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, dear. I guess that's why I got thrown the knife trees here. There's a deer. Whoa. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. Melee light knife or lantern lantern. Throwing knife, yeah. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives. I said easy. Alright, so we gonna get this. We gotta go over this Whoa, hill. Follow me, alright? It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Just over the ridge. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clear down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellers armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you, strangers? Yep. And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. 
Uh, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait huh. so you can tell him yourself. <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. I'm gonna deal with this first fella. Okay, go to work. We're here. We don't need nothing else from you. Get the rest of my stuff. We got a bunch of guys up here we're gonna have to take out. What we doing about him? What are we doing? Take him quiet, Marston. Okay. Get your hands dirty for a change. Jesus. We gotta okay. keep on creeping now. Out. What? We're at the perimeter. Wait on my mark. Wanna take a look at these boys? Sure thing. the best bet for this guy. that one up. We 
I guess I missed that one. We gotta move. Cause there's guys over there to the side or it's like really gonna do this one. Try from checkpoint. I kind of go overzealous there. Okay, now what? We're at the perimeter. Time to move on them. You ready? As I'll ever be. Let's go. How you doing, old Driscolls? Go. I don't want to pick him up. No! Don't pick him up! We, we gotta loot him. We're, we're gonna be. Because we gotta, we gotta loot all these guys. That's how we gonna get rich. Give me some of that Irish gold. What you stashing in here? You got supplies, you drunk dead bastard. You said you was looking for coal. What you got, O'Driscoll? Ain't you checking the cabin for coal? Alright, so we're going to head into this cabin. We're going to see exactly what they got in there. I knew what oh, wait, there's two more bodies over here. 
Is he looting them too? My yeah, I guess on. he is. Give it up. All right. We going to check out the cabin. Is there anybody in here? That's a real question. Are they gonna jump out and try to surprise me? Was that? Oh. You all right? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> Come on, Driscoll. He ain't here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here! He was here, I swear! I sw I, <coughs> if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. You're lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there? Without you? Como just was gonna lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, <laughs> let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. There's cash you tell in the John chimney. It ain't worth killing just yet. <laughs> right you are. A dollar. Search the drawer. Let's see if there's anything in there. Nothing really in there. Is there? Five shotgun shells. See, this is the thing. Is like I don't want to switch my repeater for a double barrel. If that makes any amount of sense. Elixir. We got ourselves some biscuits, some shotguns. Let's get it. Search the cabinet. Kentucky bourbon, canned strawberries. I'll tell you what. There's a little bit of money here, but there's not like a lot like I thought there was. Yeah, there ain't much in here. Dude, that thing's dirty as all hell. The question is, do I drop? Ah, uh, we gonna keep it. Go. 
least you got something tucked away. Six hundred doll hairs. Wait a second. We gotta loot him. Let's loot him. Loot up! Alright. Let's go. Okay, so we are kind of like pretty well north of the, uh, what should we call it? County hunting, newspaper, gunsmith. Saloon, general store. Alright. Now, let's head back down here. Let's get it going. Get it, shoddy. Get it, shoddy. Okay, so just because I dropped the bow doesn't mean it doesn't stay in my inventory. That was one thing I was worried about was like, if I dropped it, would it stay in my inventory? And I wasn't sure, and now it is. Yo, what up, Dirty? What you up to, man? I travel along. I'm over here deep in thought, admiring this game. This game is actually a really beautiful game, man. I think what I'm gonna do starting tomorrow is just get up early, play this. What's up? What's up, Dirty? Well, I mean, yeah. What are you doing? Anyways, what you up to, man? Have you played Red no. Dead Redemption? Yeah, I know it doesn't seem like you're... I've only been here for 30... I'm, I'm sorry! I'm sorry, man! I, I Listen, I have been admiring how beautiful this game is, and this game's six years old. Like, this game is beautiful for a six-year-old game. I've been so deep in thought, like, just, like, admiring and watching just how the environment interacts with you and everything. It's crazy. Okay. The queasy feeling you've been having. But yeah, no, I think the plan for the week, though, is I'm going to get up early. I'm going to play this game for, like, a couple hours in the morning. And then figure something out for the uh, evening. Because it's funny how many people have gotten the hype that have been playing, like, Sea of Thieves yesterday. And then Red Dead Redemption today. So I think that's going to be the plan. So many damn animals. Oh, bro. It just dawned on me. I don't have any sour cream for my tacos. You hear a turkey? Camp funds, forty-two ninety-two. Horse right. looks fit as a fiddle. So this is the real question: Is how much do I give to the camp? It looks like uh, they finally set up like a little place to make ammunition. Oh wait. No, I don't want to trim my hair 
or shave. I want to grow my beard out. I want to shave my head, though. What is this? Three man assault, brazen bank robbery. I can't read all of it. Major. Oh, Jesus, that's a lot to read. No, I'm not reading all that. I'm going to pretend like I'm Arthur. Illiterate. That's the give and take. Yeah, exactly. Yes, Mr. Bro, I'm still trying Mr. to figure Mason's out the whole message for you. He give up the head here. When it was convenient to exactly. head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few business things there. We gotta head okay. to Emerald Ranch. Oh, Dude, let me tell you, I need to shave my head. He it's funny because I trimmed my beard thinking I was gonna start working I'm sooner. Well, and yeah. Ended up not being that way, so now my beard's growing out and my hair's growing out. So now I gotta shave my head to be uh, somewhat. Um, Only when I see you. I gotta shave my head so I look somewhat decent. We'll throw twenty dollars in there. Actually, we'll do we'll do thirty. Yeah, we did 30 bucks. And then what else can we contribute? It says we can give item. So we'll we'll donate. We can donate that. Donate one of these. Dude, I you know, it's funny you say that, right? Because when I had hair on top of my head, I could not grow a beard. The second the Lord took my, my hair on top of my head away, I grow an amazing beard. It's, it's been that way for years now. Platinum band. We'll, we'll give that to him too. So we donate a whole bunch of stuff. All right. Um, but yeah, it's just one of those things. Like you just, you you're a hundred percent right. It's the give and take. Sure. Why are you walking around so sad? I'm not sad, just bored. You really bored. need you boys to get out there and hunt. Bored's good. Supplies are low. Bored means you ain't scared. Be grateful for being bored, lady. Fine. Soon enough, they're gonna be sure scared. You get a good price for it. Ammo oh, fat, girl, stringy meat. meat. Gritty fish oh, meat. I used to dream a lot. Mature venison? We all dream no, a we'll we'll donate the feathers. And we grew into women. Oh, hi, Uncle. Saw what the world was for us. Sure. Well a little make money. And we'll donate the animal fat. Guess. Good job, Arthur. Cheer up. Man, it's like nobody else is doing anything. Yo, what's up, Lampos? How you doing, man? Hi. This all I got for you. Either that or something. Morgan. Hopefully you're doing well, dude. Well, don't mind All right, here. Let's see if we can't get some of these time. other things that base camp opened up. What does this do? Okay. Okay. Zoom in, zoom out, flip. I can't read that. Good, how about you? Dude, I'm doing freaking amazing. So I was like, I'm going to play a different game today, more of a change of pace. And I'm like, I'm going to play some Red Dead Redemption. And then after thinking about it, I think what the plan is, is I'm going to play Red Dead Redemption first thing in the morning. And then in the evening, I'll play a different game. Because I really do want to beat this game, but I have a feeling I won't be able to... Hey, there's a little kid here. Why are you looking at me? But, uh, we'll figure it out from there. How's your day going, man? You going good? I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. Just see that I do. Oh, you will. 
I bought some more comics. What comics did you get? Thank you for saving my life. You know, I got... I have to dig it out, but I have a whole bunch of graded comics that I have invested into. When you grab a bowl of stew, you need to wait a few days before being able to grab another one. I ain't seen nobody freaking... I know, I am too. Like I said, I, I emailed him. I haven't heard back yet. And I was talking with Gary, and Gary said he still hasn't even gotten his back. And we both sent him off at the same time. But, uh, but I don't understand why. I'm the only one doing work around here. And I have to wait to get more stew all right is that a chicken yeah it's a chicken yeah i'm waiting on the graded cards and i'm waiting i'm waiting on my lady miss karen all good that's what i'm saying bro fucking gary sent off three i sent off one so four in total somehow that doesn't surprise me stay alert Actually, I need to go to my horse. I need to get my bow. The death of Superman, Robin, and more Superman. Dude, uh, see, that's the thing. Is like, I remember when the death of Superman happened. That comic was everywhere. Where's my horse? Oh, there it is. Let's go into the cargo. But yeah, the uh, I just remember the death of Superman was everywhere. I saw X-Men. Dude, X-Men is another really good one. I think I'm still in the base camp. That's why I won't let me do my weapon wheel. But, uh, yeah, dude. Like, I remember Death of Superman was freaking everywhere when, um, it came out. I don't... That's the funny part is, like, uh, the Death of Robin or Death in the Family... Well, Death in the Family was the original one where Jason Todd gets killed by the Joker. And, like, dude, that one I highly recommend. And then there's Death of a Family, which is the death of Damian Wayne. Who is technically, I guess you can say, the newest Robin. Mr. Arthur, I told Dutch I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Down here? What they want? I have no idea. They see you? I don't think so. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know, Karen. Mm-hmm. All right. Come over here. Evening, Arthur. What's up, dude? So, we got all these undiscovered perks. My weight is average. Well-being ain't there. I was like, Casey would like that comic. Yeah. Dude, like, uh, like I said, if you ever get the chance, I would, I would say don't buy the singles, buy the graphic novel. What do you want? All these people keep bothering me, but anyways, buy the graphic novel to read. It's called Marvels. It's illustrated by Alex Ross, who does like hyper realistic illustrations. It's beautiful. Like his art is amazing. Um, it's called Marvels, and it takes place from the point of view of, um, whatchamacallit, from uh, the point of view of people on the street. So there's, like, there's one comic where it's, like, 
uh, Spider-Man Green Goblin fighting above the streets in New York and the people that are affected down below with, like, falling rubble and all that stuff. Bro, like, it's so, so good. Like, I highly Arthur. recommend it. Dutch? Talk to him. Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. No. The whole world's changed. I used to... They don't want folk like us no more. Well, technically I've been to Comic-Cons, but hunted. not the big Comic-Cons. We are Cons. smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah. Dutch. Uh-oh. Uh, What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. Like, uh... They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah in the when, sheriff's um, in Strawberry. I There's actually lived in it's San open. Diego for years. Arthur. What? And I mean Who years. Who brought this on himself? You know my feelings and, about um, him, I think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside. I was never He's able to get tickets man. to go no, to the Comic-Con in San Diego. Fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I but I've been to the Comic-Con in Santa Barbara. You for you. And of course the mom and pop Comic-Cons that pop up here and there. Fine, all right, Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah. Of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Huh. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. The other, uh, the other thing I like to go to... Yo, what's up, Liz? Uh, the other thing I really like going to is like card shows and comic shows and stuff like that. Just collectible shows in general. That one's so fun. Boston Comic Con. No, I haven't been there. Truth be told, I've never been to Boston. I rode the, as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. The most hey, north like I've ever been, been was Syracuse in New York, but I've never been to Boston. Finally get off that mountain, then I've never yes. even been to Massachusetts, Mike truth be told. A crazy side off it. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was... You worry too much, kid. Anyways, Liz, how's just, your day? You back home? Just a business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Mike knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even <laughs> tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? <coughs> I'll come with you. Uh, you to me. For now, let's yeah, drink some. I was thinking Forget the same thing. Me. I have like, it was I, I, I did. I was. All this. We'll just have a couple. Settle you down and head back. Okay. So it's funny okay. you say that because like I was now, thinking the same thing that it was freaking I hot. I love where Nina, I live, dude. Like, Boston's one place I really want to go and visit. What kind of fight? Uh, Nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. Because, like, so I'm from the East Here Coast. I'm originally from... Why is this... Yeah, I'm from the East Coast originally. I lived, uh... I lived... I grew up in Virginia. Good evening, sir. Excuse Good evening. me. Can you move, please? Bitch, don't tell me what to do. But, uh... Yeah, I was thinking that it was hot as hell, but I'm like, I'm not going to turn on, like, the, uh... Air conditioner, because it's not that hot. I mean, it's hot, but not hot. All right, let's get in here. Let's get let's get old dude some drinks, drinky drinks. But yeah, I used to run all up and down the East Coast all the time. My dad's from Maryland. I'm from Virginia. We do all kinds of stuff. Just one or two, right, Arthur? 
course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. Now you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Micah... A lot Mike... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, 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 there, Dullards! My lord, you men is dull. <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone. For Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. We're gonna do this. But me and the kid here, we're trying to talk business. So yeah, I'm playing on the PlayStation right now. Possibly leave us alone. No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just trying to be friendly. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> I thought about playing it. Lenny, where are you? I thought about playing it on my um You know which way my friend went? I don't know, sorry. My friend, you know where we went? No, sorry. Benny? Hey, you see my friend anywhere? Sorry. He's like, nope. Oh, nice. Benny, where are you? How's, uh, how's that going, anyway? See that fella I was with? No, no. You like going live on Twitch? Benny! Got I think he's gotta be upstairs. He probably picked up a hooker. But yeah, turn on your uh, your oven with it kind of warm. That's no bueno, man. Okay, so the barber's in the saloon. I'm gonna have to remember that. I was playing on Vi Dude, Vice City. It's one of the greatest Grand Theft Autos in my opinion. Excuse me. What are you doing, kid? Hello, Arthur. Yeah, I knew it. He picked up a prostitute. You know what? I don't know. <coughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Cookie orders need to be filled. I know. <laughs> Why ain't you never met? Yeah, Tommy. Your mouth, That's kind of funny. Mister. What is going on here? Bastard! Get in, my boy! I'm Clyde. You 
<laughs> I'm Clyde. Dude. Damn it, Danny, stop slumping off on me. Just go home, will you? Lenny, where are you hiding now? He's got to be upstairs. Lenny! I think this is him. Found Lenny. Cheers. Not you again. Yeah. We're gonna be the good guy here. As I'm running into every post. You won your basketball game? Nice, dude. I know. I think it's because I'm playing like a different, different game. You alive? How many we got in here? You alive, Arthur? I want to die. Where are what did we do? I don't know. Oh, me neither. <sighs> yeah. You pair degenerates. <sighs> There's a fine for drunk. What position you play anyways, Lamp? You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> Neither you fools got any money. It's ten dollars and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either you around here no more. So, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off goddamn Mikey. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down and feel sorry for myself. I have no idea where my hat's at. There's a doctor. There's a sheriff. Where's the saloon? I need to get my hair cut. There we go. There's my horse. All right, let's go. Just got into town, mister. Hopefully the barber's in. Right? I hate going to school in the morning. Uh, hello there, Dude, sir. I, I feel you. Don't think I've seen you around here before. Oh, my God. What's it to be? Hair. You know what? We have styles. Buzz. 
We're, we gonna go bold. Better than you hoped, I bet. And then let's see, facial hair. No. Dude, he looks like Walter White with that. So we're just gonna we're gonna keep the shaved head. That's all we wanted. All right, doing pretty right. good. Our work here is done. Yes, it is. Hear about that ruckus over Good morning, camp. Mister. Morning. Brought some new girls into town. Thanks, partner. Uh, looks like I'm gonna have to go buy me a new another hat. So we go to the general store over here. General store in there. What's up? I knew you'd be back. Have a look around. Well, that was we need a hat. I can get you anything in there you need. It is in giving that we receive the clothing. Gifts of life that are eternal. Hats. <laughs> so give generously, for that is what this country needs to help each other. Bro, these hats are fourteen dollars. What? I don't like that hat. Cigarette. I don't like that hat neither. Seem a bit taken with that. I don't like that hat. We're gonna have to find ourselves a good hat. Yes. Western flat hat. No. Um. I definitely need like a 10 gallon hat. The Panama hat. <coughs> 150, $115 for that hat, bro. You like that? Let's see. I wonder what this one looks like. Nah, it's all tattered and stuff. Uh, now we're moving into like clothes, clothes. Um, I guess the more we do, the more stuff that will be unlocked. Those go pretty fast. Actually, let's take a look and see what the accessories. What are considered accessories? So you got gloves, suspenders, spurs. Oh, dude, there's all kinds of stuff in here. People have been talking about a curse in Valentine as long as I can remember. Some think reckon it, this was Indian land once, but I ain't sure. Let's go. Hey, let's go to the horse because I think the horse. To you. Let's see. My hat should be. At least I thought the hat should be in here. You know, you got a memorable face. Real easy to identify. Yeah, right, let's go. Uh, let's go get a bath. This will probably stink. So for seventy, overall straw hat. And some Tim's, and they'd be good to go. Yeah, you ain't lying. We, we need to bathe, man. Wait. Okay, so we got our bath. And guess what? For 50 cents more, we can get, we can get a hooker to bathe us. I mean, that's the best thing in the world after, like, you cut your head. I can smell you across town. What? What are you talking about? We're, we're going to do the uh, deluxe, can baby. Can I get a hand in here, please? I, I can tell you. <laughs> Hello, mama. Just relax. 
I'll take care of you. What do you mean you can smell me from across town? I ain't stinky. I actually got a bath this morning. Let me know if I'm this scrubbing morning. too hard, okay? Sorry if I don't forget to wash the rest of me. <laughs> sure, whatever you want. But no, that's like the best feeling in the world is like when you um reckon that part's clean you enough. Freaking, uh, you freaking uh you shave your head and everything and then you get a bath. No, that's baby head. Dude, baby head. Just yank your new chain. Oh my god. Oh my right, god. Baby, work on somewhere else now. But yeah, no, baby Not heads. See, I, you you got me saying baby head and she walked in and she's like I know you're streaming. I want you to pat me on the head, but I don't want to be on camera. I love you, baby. Yeah. Yeah, you're such a good girl. You're such a good girl. Yes, you are. I love you, baby head. All right. So All we're right. nice and clean. I think do it. Grab her while you can't. Nah, she just darted Goodbye out. Now. She walked in. She let me pat her on the head, and then she darted out. Don't let her escape. Baby head, get over here. Mission failed. I know. Wasted. That's what it is. <laughs> Just like Grand Theft Auto. Alan! Yeah, Liz, I think Alan was talking about taking me over to the VR strip club later. Dude, he looks like shit. Here. Oh my god! Be generous. Help people. Try to do what you can. We're we're gonna we're gonna go and I wanna see how far down the rabbit hole it goes. Dude, if you want, I love that game. What VR chat? I can hit up a friend of mine. She does like the whole VR stripping thing and she will take you down the rabbit hole, dude. Like, I am. That would be so funny. Can I come? No, you're too young, homie. And find some. Oh, dude, yeah. She could hook you up with that. Like, she hooked me up with, like, a bunch of freaking Avatar skins. I'll have to hit her up. Like, she has um, entire worlds that you can go to. And it's just, like, rows and rows of Avatar skins. And, like whatever you're looking for you can find it and, and like vr chat and like i'm gonna just throw this out there chat is uh vr chat is not something that i could potentially stream only because like the <laughs> the um looking good yeah but uh no the uh the stuff that happens in there yeah it's not safe for work at all like, who was it? I think it was Mizkif that got uh, banned on Twitch for streaming VR chat. And all he was doing was, like, VR chat dating or something like that. And, like, he wasn't even doing anything crazy. That's the funny part. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, it is It's super lame. I mean, okay, I can understand... Well, have fun. I need to focus. Why? You focus it? Bro. No, so it's funny because, like, my friend, like, when she was showing me around VR chat, right? When she was trying to explain to me what she does in there, um, the avatar skin that she has, it's like a, um, whatchamacallit? It, it, it's an interactive skin. So you can sit there and you can, like, like, you smack her arm and, like, depend on how hard you smack her arm. Bye! You leaving lamp post? But yeah, depending on how hard you smack her arm, you can like see handprints and stuff like that. It's insane. It's insane what they can do with like avatars in VR chat. Um right now. Baby. 
But yeah. Good night, dude. Good night, Lampost. Have a good one, dude. Leopold Strauss. Money lending and other sins. Let's go, cool, girl. There's my head. I was like, I know I got my head somewhere on here. Yeah, VR chat is definitely a very interesting place. It's not for the faint of heart. Driscoll saying so. Understand me? Consider this a warning. What? Go on! Get lost! Right down you go! Ah! Ah! Hey, they threatened me first! I ain't playing. <laughs> it gave me snake oil. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep on going. I feel like the O'Driscolls are like, O'Doyle rules! O'Doyle rules! Hold on, wait a second. I'm seeing a bunch of stuff. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I, there's... Javier's way out there. Micah's way out there. The question is, do we head out to Horsia? There's a stable over here. Or do we... Here, we'll, we'll head out to Horsia. We'll see what's up with him. Took that some bitch down. Or we might as well take this back to camp. I'm gonna stow that bad boy away. Decent hunt, girl. Come on, girl. Alright. So we took down that horse i mean that a deer we'll, we'll head back to base camp we'll turn that in because 
Like, we don't want them to starve, if that makes any amount of sense. But, I have to give it a couple days before I go and I get anything else. <coughs> Food-wise, which is dumb. God damn it. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Turkey, back. Who's there? It's me, fool. Arthur, the hero returns. A hero returns. Welcome in, everybody. Hopefully, you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful evening. Don't forget, yeah. mash that like button and subscribe. Every little bit helps out, man. You guys are freaking awesome. You guys have gotten me to the point where I'm at right now. I couldn't do it without you guys. Hard, girl. Let's go and take the buck over. <clears throat> I think we gotta come over here. Hello, Arthur. You been on the run again? and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, skill tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Okay, okay. I'm I'll keep my thinking about it. For him. So it looks like we're gonna have, these are all like legendary stuff. Four boar skin. What do we need for this? Perfect pronghorn hides. I'll need you to go find me the right materials before I can make that. Oh well, yeah, no shit. So we need snake skin banjo. Campfire seat covers. Campfire log seat covers. Learn to cow hide ground covers. Hide ground covers. Hide ground covers. Oh, we could craft that. Boy Scouts will be very pleased. Makes you wonder if Boy Scouts were around during that time. It makes you feel a bit more like home. What else are we going to need? Because I've donated a lot of money. <clears throat> I donate a lot of food. Donate a little bit of everything. Yo, what up, Trout? Are you well? I think I just gotta keep donating crap to this. Some of them. Because otherwise, like, these some bitches are gonna starve. They don't know what to do without me. But yet. If I wanted more than one bowl of stew, even though I've donated everything, they would throw a bitch fit. All right. Um, let's see. Where are we going to go next? That is the real question. Um, well, let's... Just like rigid religion. Absolutely. Cause like, like I said, that was, I think I told you that story. 
that one priest that was like, if you can't donate 10% of your earnings, the tidings, to the church, don't even show up. I ain't been to church since. Let's go. Oh my god, I gotta... Hold on, before I get too much further, I... Yep. Dude, it's like... Oh my god, that pre... Yeah, exactly. Bye, Felicia. Yeah, I couldn't stand that dude. And what's funny is, there was a lot of people that couldn't stand him. So they sent him to the Amazon to go work with... Uh, cannibal tribes down there and he ended up coming back like 10 years later so i didn't understand that at all i know i'm your like ears how are is working, it Arthur. nobody nobody can stand this dude and he like oh my god it was just terrible okay then uh, what did you want you loaning already you know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. How's he? Welcome Chick to Matthews. the fucking crew, dude. Guthrie Hope Farm. you're doing well. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there. Badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Ah, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. Try not to kill them. Claim debts from other debtors. Okay. Um... Oh, yeah, that's the other thing that kind of tripped me out, was the fact that you could go, like, first-person mode now. Dude, that's so cool. It's just like Grand Theft Auto. Alright, let's... I did not want to do that. Welcome back, welcome back. There's a deer. There's a trapper. All right, so let's set our waypoint for over there. Is this like a mountainside? Yeah, I ain't gonna be able to make it down there. I thought there would be like an easy way for me to make it down the side of this hill. And it doesn't appear like it's going to be easy. Okay. Where's my damn horse? You need the fastest horse in the game. I know. My horse is like... There we go. I got I got the mini horse right now. Like I'm wa I'm watching all these other guys run around with like these super fast horses, and then I'm over here with the pocket horse. Yep. Uh, free. Oh wait, isn't it the one like at the beginning of the game or whatever? Because I think I was reading about some stuff like that. Yeah. You can get it whenever. Okay, that makes sense. Dude, like, this game is so freaking beautiful. Like, you, there's nobody in the world that can tell me that, like, and it's been out for six years. Yeah. I know I keep saying that. Dude, stream elements popped up and I was like, what, what? Threw me off for a second. Bet you they're in the house. 
There's a chimney. Chimney's uh, got smoke coming out of it. Knock, knock, Mr. Robe. Przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh. German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, nah, the Kaiserreich. I don't speak German neither. I'm here for money. 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 That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh-huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's a very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh, no. He lives alone. Okay. Oh, no. I'll have to do that. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Study it. Oh, I'm going to have to give no, that a try. I understand you. God damn it. You have a debt to Herr Strauss. Pay up. Stop. You stream I'm Shiwi. No. No, no. Give me the money. Ah, no, 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 no. Please, no. I don't have money, but, but I have this. Well, hand it to me then. It's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's, it's Warsaw, yes. I have your things. Okay? I have anything in here or out there. Yes. Well, looks like we're taking some stuff. Better be so that horse is fast somewhere. I'm here. Brush it and all that stuff. Dude, yeah, I freaking feel you on that. Very good. Fine good yet. Speak English. No, 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 no. Yes. Check these other yes, ones. Yes, yes, yes. I was like, why won't it let me search the chest? You must have come here with something. It's like nothing. Is there like nothing in there? Nothing. All right, there's a drawer over here. So when you gonna do this? Do what? What am I gonna do? You mean get the fastest horse in the game? I don't know yet. I haven't gotten that far. VR? I don't know yet. I'm having a lot of fun with Red Dead. How late are you uh, staying up for? What time are you going to bed anyways? Come on. It's 9.30. Uh, it is 9.30. I didn't even realize that. There's like legitimately nothing in here. He had like a watch, some fine brandy, and that's it. Evan! I need, I must eat, Okay, that should about cover things.
collect another debt. So return to uh, return the debt to the camp funds. Okay. Yeah, it's six there, right? Yeah, it is. Pooky bear. Six thirty to be exact. So like, there's not a lot, and I've only been playing for like, th th yeah, two hours and forty minutes. I haven't been, I haven't really been live long. And that's one angry horse. gonna kick you yeah I saw I saw it rearing and freaking out oh, I wonder if it'll kick me off I'm thinking about taking this and selling it yep Because, like, if I take it and sell it, bro, jump on it. Yeah. I wonder how much money I can make for it. Punt you in the face. <laughs> I was expecting it to punt me in the face. This horse is fast. Compared to my normal horse? Shit. Dude, I saw that happen. So, I used to work horse farms growing up, right? And I remember... Um... One time, there was a, um... This guy, he had a Australian, um... An Aussie. And the Aussie was a fucking piece of shit. No, it was a Queensland. Queensland healer. It was a it was just a piece of shit, dude. This dog would like bite everybody. Like it bit me in the ass twice while I was like trying to corral some horses. And um anyways. Freaking this dog was out in the uh the paddocks we had. But, uh, yeah, this freaking, this dog, bro. Mister, I don't hardly know this what dog to caught... say. Thanks, I guess. You done me a service. This dog caught a hey, hoof to the eye. The stage company's gonna write this off as a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. It ain't stealing if it's already stolen. Yeah, he ain't lying. Got that right. But yeah, dude. That thoroughbred, yeah. No, you ain't lying about that. Jackass! That's move. How are you calling a jackass, asshole? So, anyways, yeah, I just remember he's gonna he's gonna call me in. But uh, yeah. So this dog was out. And freaking biting these horses on the underside, and one of the horses caught it right in the eye. Dog's name was uh, Kentucky Best Horses. Ah, y'all got some good horses. I'll give you that. But yeah, dude, I'll never forget that. That dog, 
Ran around one eye. The rest of it's like. I was so happy when it got kicked too in the eye. Cause it was such a motherfucker. Okay, we're close. Since this is stolen horse, we're gonna sell it. Makes me wonder how much I'm gonna get for it. Good to see you back. Please be generous. Be generous. Help people. Try to do what you can. It will be retrieved for you while entering the stable. Okay. If you sell and I can only sell this damn horse for six bucks. We'll sell it. I'm sure someone will want this. Remember. <coughs> Remember, it's better to give than to receive. Yeah, how much money do I have? <coughs> it's Dutch. The Dutch warm blood. Let's make this country a brotherhood of man. So give what you can. How many horses? For I just have together. Tennessee Walker, yeah. We can be one. You should donate that $6. To that yet man yelling, no. Clear of the wind talk in this town. He's either too churchy or liable to get you itchy. I don't even We're remember owning an orphanage in San Denis. Please give if you can. <laughs> Handling race standard. Standard. I'm really thinking. I'm gonna buy this American standard. What should I name him? Chat, tell me what should I name him? Give me something good. Something good. Something long. I don't know what I should name him. That's the problem. You talking about Mr. Ed? Mr. Ed. The famous Mr. Ed. That's what we're going to name him. Nice. You only live once. Are you doing all you can? Use your... Uh, tax and services. Use your Is this it? No, that's not it. We're going to go to services. We're going we're gonna to get the horse care package. It's like the extended package for the horse, man. All right. Oh, bro. He's so much faster and easier to handle. Alright. Now, I did not want to click on story. Let's take a look at the map. Mm. Let's go and donate to the camp because that's where it's telling us we have to go. I'm only giving those cocksuckers last time I played. Oh, yeah. They'll do that. I've been kind of just wanting to go and do story missions. That's the biggest thing I really wanted to do. Have you... Well, how far have you gotten in this game anyways, Alan? I know I was watching you play a little bit on stream. Actually, speaking of which, you should probably play this on stream again. Should. 
like try to pop a couple things. Got ourselves a turkey, boys. We're gonna skin it. Should I just pick it up or just skin it and then pick it up? I'm gonna skin it and then pick it up. I think that's gonna be the better plan. Eastern wild turkey. You wouldn't think that like, that's big enough to stow, but I guess. Let's go, girl. All right, let's make it back to camp. Identify yourself. Arthur, dumbass. Grab a wild turkey. All right, let's put this. Got some blood on you there, Arthur. Hurry let's give up. This over here to them. We could really use some more meat, Mr. Morgan. Plump bird meat. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. Thank you, Arthur. All right, let's go give uh, money to the bank over here. I ain't gonna contribute anymore. Wait, I can I purchase upgrades for the camp? All right, let's take a look at the ledger. Let's see what all kind of upgrades we can get for it at least. Man, look at this. John, Bill, Sadie, Lenny, Charles, Charles. Like, one, one's $5.59, and you look at me, $1.50, $30, $3, $8. Like, Um, mm -hmm. first things first, Dutch wants something more comfier. I think the leather wor working tools might be revolver pistol improve our offense repeater ammo and arrows restock eight dollars yo what's up snass how you doing man thank you thank you thank you thank you yeah i've been working on this beard for a couple years now i actually just trimmed it short all right so we have 130 so we're gonna purchase this So we got an upgrade to the medicine wagon. And then I think what we're going to do is we're going to do the next upgrade. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. <laughs> good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's a pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. <laughs> nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Hey, Venom Buddy Twitch, thank you for the follow, man. 
You're freaking awesome. Keep doing what you do. <clears throat> All right. Let's go back to the ledger. Purchase another upgrade. You can now pay to resupply the pantry when stocks are low. Nice. Okay. Chewing tobacco and premium canned goods. All right. You are too hard on him. He he writes. Let's uh let's go. Yes. Right. He's very. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Do we go and we do we go and do that or? Chicken Matthews. This has to be like a legendary spot to hunt. All right, let's go to the Thomas Dow's. Ornamental, as my uncle would say. And your uncle, what was he? He was a slave. Most educated man in his county, but a slave. Why is the dominoes locked? Girl. Keep going. Yeah. All right, let's go collect some more debts. make this thing fat. expecting the damn thing to buck me off. We're gonna, we're, we're gonna skin it, and then we're gonna throw it on the back of the horse, bring it back. Buck out here. And then let's come over here. Man, it's probably because I shot the damn thing like ten times. But it's like poor buck here. Would I be able to stow this? That's us. Okay, girl. Let's pull up the map. We're actually not far from uh, base camp, are we? No, because it's right here. Watch is like get, get your ass. Yep. 
Anyway, hope you had a good old time. That dumb son bitch was looking right at me, and it still was like, "Who goes there?" Fish care. How you getting up? Just stay alert. Oh, I shall do. If anyone tries anything, I'll blow their heads off. Why won't it let me? I was like, why won't it let me remove the whitetail book? Don't make no damn sense. Ah, Miss Morgan. You seem chipper. But where there's life, there's hope, my friend. And? Huh. I thought you just left. Very good. We were getting low. Just make sure it goes into the pot. Good job. Not your pot. There we go. See, we we getting stuff done over here. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over here. No, we ain't gonna hunt nothing until we're on our way back. We gon' we gonna get it moving. Is that wildcat I just heard? Arthur. No! Where do those guys come from? I thought it was in pretty good health, too. I thought it was in pretty good health. I guess I wasn't. Yo, Driscoll's. At least my horse didn't die. Need you now, girl. So we're going the right way. Let's go and beat the shit out of this guy. Hang on right. Keep it going. Dude, like I, I keep saying it, six years this game has been out and it is so beautiful. It's such a beautiful, beautiful game. It's so beautiful, I missed my turn.
Mr. Downs! Downs! Where are you? Oh. oh shit. Oh shit. Go, go, go. That was a close one. He's gotta be in the house. Go through the back door. Shut up, dog. Oh, there he is. I'm surprised he ain't said nothing. Sir, I'm. I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Oh, please, I have a family, sir. Please. I don't care about your family. You owe me money. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe. Is all I require. A little patience. <laughs> you ain't such a do gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts, I'm I'm not running anywhere. I'm I'm, I'm if I'm here, there's a reason I'm here. <sighs> you borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back. What's not to understand? <laughs> oh, my Where's God. our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. We ain't your idea of <laughs> charity. Is that clear? <laughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. Damn. That's all I gotta say. Finally upgrade some stuff. Some stuff. And uh oh, here comes Baby Head and the old man himself, Logan. Mm. 
I think right there might be let's go let's go close out this mission did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Huh. Let's take a look at the map. So we got a bunch of stuff to unlock. We still gotta come over here. Over here. But, I think we're going full screen. I think right there is a good place to end. I wanna thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me. I think, like I said, this week what I'm gonna do is every morning I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna get a couple hours of red dead redemption in and then from there we'll figure out what game we're going to play for the evening but i just want to thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out it really does mean a lot to me it means a lot to the channel and you guys are awesome keep doing what you do anyways you guys i will catch you guys later have a wonderful wonderful rest of your evening and uh i'm out